tower, separation of the first tower. Copy the first umbilical now separating from the rocket. Umbilical tower separation in process. Copy that. And concur. T minus 20 seconds and counting. Second tower separate. Turbo pumps at flight speed. We have ignition of the Soyuz. Excellent thrust. And liftoff. Liftoff as Chris Cassidy, Pavel Vinogradov, and Alexander Mazurkin are on a fast track to the International Space Station. stage performance. The Soyuz is delivering 102 tons of thrust from its four boosters and single engine. The first stage of the Soyuz measures 68 feet in length and 24 feet in diameter. It is burning liquid fuel for the first two minutes and six seconds of flight. We Soyuz 34 continuing to close in on the International Space Station, parts of the Russian segment and the truss of the International Space Station very clearly coming into view now. There's a look at the Soyuz 34 from the Space Station's cameras as it continues to close in. These two vehicles are traveling high above the South Pacific Ocean, currently just to the west of South America. Yeah. The range rate is going down 80 meters, we will just move four. Copy. This vehicle is 80 meters away from the International Space Station, approaching between one and two meters per second. 80 meters, we will just move four. Copy, less than a minute prior to night. 40 meters. Copy. Our VKA. Our VKA. Right here in the middle. We are now in the night. The target is nearly at the very center. Далее 4, скорость 0. Just a few meters now in between the Soyuz and the International Space Station standing by for contact and capture. The tag is the center. In place. Okay. Waiting for the search for the capture. So congratulations. Contact and capture confirmed at 9.28 p.m. Central Time, 10.28 p.m. Eastern Time. The two vehicles flying high above the Pacific Ocean, just to the west of Peru. Once again, Chris Cassidy, Alexander Mazurkin, and Pavel Vinogradov have arrived at the International Space Station after close to six hours from launch to docking. So this is our final destination, final station.